here. Welcome to your Summit Yoga Power Sequencing Day. All right, got some good stuff for you. You're gonna need a 10 or a seven pound soul mace, and we're gonna get warmed up through spinal waves and mountain climbers. All right, so start in child's pose, send your hips to your heels, knees wide, sit deep into your hips, move your arms out in front. Make sure you extend your arms all the way out so your elbows come off the ground. Take some deep, full breaths. Good. On your inhale, you're gonna round and roll up through cat pose, so rounding through your spine, hollow body, and then slowly draw your hips down to allow your spine into extension. Press your shoulders away from your ears and lift your chin up high to the sky. Inhale, exhale, chin to your chest, round into your shoulders, draw your body up and in, and send your hips back to your heels, child's pose. Again, spinal wave all the way through. Inhale, round it up and open it up. Lift your chin and then shift your chest up and over. Again, down the roll, cat pose, and hips down, open to extension. And shift your chest. All right, tuck your toes under, lift your hips up high, downward facing dog. Pedal out your heels here. Rooting your heels down to the ground, lift the opposite and alternating sides. All right, extend your right leg high, stack your hip and bend your knee, and let's do big circles, drawing your knee in a big circle, three in each direction, and switch directions. Good, extend your leg, step your right foot all the way through your hands. Lower your left knee down and tuck your toes. Plant your left hand down to the ground. Extend your right arm up high. Pull the shoulder back. Good. Reach your arm back behind you. And then bring that arm down outside your leg. And up and over. Good. Big circles. Two. Inhale. Open. Exhale. Lower. Open. And lower. Switch directions. Go the opposite way. Inhale. Open. Reach back. Good, one more. And shift back, half splits. Both hands come down to the ground. Shift your hips back, and we're gonna do those hip rotations from side to side. So hips left, toes right. Hips right, toes left. Back and forth, toes right and left. Good, then back into your knees, sit back to plank pose, lower all the way down to the ground. Untuck your toes, lift your chest off the ground, baby cobra. Lower down, place your hands, tuck your toes, shoulder and press up, plank pose to downward dog. All right, here we go, left leg's gonna extend, stack your hip and your knee, big circles in one direction, three, two, one. Switch directions, one, Two, three, extend your left leg, step your foot all the way through, lower your right knee down and tuck your toes, plant your right hand underneath your shoulder, left arm extends, reach back behind you, down and around, up over your head, down and around, and switch directions. And release, bring your hips back, let your toes toward your face, and shift from side to side, toes left and right. Back into your knee, plant your hands, tuck your toes, step it back, lower all the way down to the ground. Untuck your toes, lift up, and lower your plant your hands, tuck your toes, shoulder press up, down the dog. Take a big breath. Awesome. So we're gonna move through the sequence next. There's four exercises, we're gonna do three reps each exercise. 
um, just for the demo, we're just going to um, go through it as we do the first round. So demoing as we do the first round. Um, we're going to start with bear squats. So warming up the hips here, find down our dog. We're going to do five bear squats. So I like to lift the heels up high, press your chest back, and then bend your knees. All you're doing is dropping your hips to your heels, your front part, your hands and your shoulders are not moving really. It's pushing back, keep pushing back. Three, four, and five. So this head should be on the left hand side in front of your mat. Just like that. So place it there, take some breaths and downward dog. Here we go. Right leg extends, step your right foot all the way through your hands, lower your left knee down, untuck your toes. Pick up the slow mace with an under, over grip, under on the left hand, over on the right hand, wider than your shoulders, come to cross body top to their left shoulder. So like a seat fall across your body. Sink your hips down. Try to tuck the tailbone under, engage your core right here. And then inhale, shift back, extend your left arm to cross body bottom and pull the mace apart. So it's on the open hip, the left hip. And exhale, cross body top. Inhale, cross body bottom, pull the face apart. Exhale, cross body top. Inhale, cross body bottom. And exhale, cross body top. Nice. From here, you can either use the ground to support you to tuck the left toe, lift the left knee into a high lunge. Now moving into a high lunge, you're gonna switch the slow mace up and over. So right hand comes up and turn the thumb down and come to an over, over grip so palms are facing out. Front low position, still his head is over their front right knee, which is bent over the ankle. We're gonna do overhead press to shoulder pull. So everything is stacked. Inhale, pull the mace apart, extend both legs, and extend your arms over your head. Reach back behind you if you have enough range. Pull the still mace back to your shoulders. You bend both knees again. Inhale, press overhead. Try not to play out your rib cage. Keep your rib cage down and engage. And exhale back to your shoulders. If you can't come back to your shoulders, come back to the front load position, into the front. After round two, after the second rep, third one is going to come back to the front. Great. Now we're going to open up into warrior two. So line and open up your hips, reach your right knee over your ankle. Take your right hand and turn your right hand under. So under, over, grip, cross body, top, right shoulder. So moving into warrior two, bicep extension. You're gonna straighten your leg as you inhale. Push the slow mace in together as you extend it out to the right. Bend your right knee as you do so. Once you get to extension, keep your right elbow slightly bent. Pull the mace apart at the end. Push the mace back in together to come back to your cross body top position. So three reps here. Inhale, straighten your right leg. Push the mace in together and slowly bend your right knee over your ankle as you extend it out. Inhale, pull the mace apart. Exhale, bring it back in. Inhale, straighten. Exhale, reach it up. Inhale, pull. Exhale, bring it in. Great job. Moving into a lateral lunge, vertical front press, straighten your right leg, turn your right toes in. Don't move your hand position, but move the still mace to a vertical grip. We're moving on to the left side. We're doing the left lateral lunge with a front vertical press. So pull the mace apart. Bend your left knee, inhale as you exhale, extend your arms as you move it to the left. Extend and pull the mace apart. Inhale, straighten your left, bring your arms back in, and exhale, press it out. Inhale, pull it in, exhale, press it out. Great. Rotate to your right, plant the still mace to the right hand side, take the vinyasa. Moving into the left side. So many heads should be on the right hand side in front of your mat. We're gonna do five bear squats. Lift your heels up high. Here we go, hips to your heels. One, two, full extension of your legs all the way up and all the way down. Four, and five, great. Here we go, left leg extends. Step your left foot all the way through your hands. Lower your right knee down and tuck your toes. Under, over, grip. Right hand is under, left, left hand is over. Sink your hips down, here we go. Inhale to cross body bottom. Exhale to cross body top. Your left hand is rotating around the still mace handle. Inhale, cross body bottom, pull the mace apart, full extension of your arm. Exhale, cross body top. 
Inhale, cross body bug. Exhale, cross body top. Great, if you need to, plant the slow base down, lift your right knee, find stability from the ground up. And then you're gonna switch the slow mains up and over, left thumb comes down, over, over grip. So mains head is on the left hand side now. Get ready to press. All right, here we go. Inhale, press overhead. Exhale, bend your elbows, bend your knees, come back to your shoulders. Inhale, press, engage your core. Exhale, shoulder pull. Last one, come back to front low position. Great, open up warrior two. So line your heels. Widen your stance. Left hand is going to come under, so waist head. Under over grip, left shoulder, cross body top. Get ready for your bicep extension, straighten your leg, inhale. And your exhale, push your so waist in together, bend your left knee. Inhale, float apart at the end. Push it back together. Exhale, inhale. Extend, exhale, reach it out. Inhale, fold. Exhale, bring it in. Inhale, last one. Exhale, reach it out. Inhale. Exhale, bring it in. And done. Train your left leg, turn your left toes in. Left hand up top, face and belly button level. We're gonna to go to the right, bending into your right knee to a front press as you lateral lunge. Inhale fully. Exhale, press. Inhale, pull. Exhale, press. Inhale, pull. And exhale, press. Great. Rotate to the right. Plant the soulmate's head on the left hand side. Sit back to plank pose, vinyasa. Good, two more rounds, take a breath. Five bear squats, let's go. Two, three, four, and five. All right, starting with the right leg again. Step your right foot all the way through. Lower your left knee down, untuck your toes. Pick up the soulmate's under over grip, left shoulder. Shake your hips down. Here we go. Inhale, cross body bottom. Stand. Exhale, cross body top. Shift back. Shift down. Inhale, shift back. Cross body bottom. Exhale, shift down. Cross body top. Last one. Option just to tuck the toe and lift the knee or use the ground for support. Over, over grip. So my head is going to go on the right hand side. With an over, over grip. Both knuckles are to the sky. Get ready to move. Inhale, press. Exhale, shoulder pull. Inhale, press. To the shoulder. Last one. Front low position. Open up warrior two. Align your foundation first. Take your right hand. Bring it under. Cross body top. Right shoulder. Take a breath. Here we go. Find that bicep extension. Inhale. Straighten your leg. Exhale. Bend your knee. Reach it out. Inhale. Hold. Exhale. Pull it in. Here we go, two, reach it out. Last one. Great job. Lateral lunge to the left. So straighten your right leg, right toes in. Right hand up top, going to the left, inhale. Exhale to the left. Pull it in, inhale. To the left. Inhale. And to the left. Good, rotate left. Plant the slow mace, vinyasa. Number two on the left hand side. Take a breath. Bear squats. Here we go. Three, two, one. Left leg lifts. Inhale. Step it all the way through. Lower your right knee down and tuck your toes. Under over grip. So mace head on the right shoulder. Here we go. Sink your hips down. Inhale, shift back, cross body bottom. Exhale, cross body top. Inhale to the bottom. To the top. Bottom. To the top. High lunge. How are you going to get there? Switch the so mace to the left hand side. Over, over grip. So mace head is over the left knee. Get ready to move. From low position. Inhale, press overhead. Exhale, shoulder pull. Two more. Last one. Front load. Open up warrior two. Left hand comes under. Cross body top, left shoulder. Get ready for your bicep extension. Inhale, straighten. Exhale, extend. Hold, inhale. Bring it back in. Inhale, extension. 
Exhale, reach, bend your knees. Inhale, hold. Exhale, bring it in. Last one. Great job, moving into that lateral lunge. Straight your left leg. Left toes in, going into the right side. Inhale. Exhale, right, press. Inhale, pull. Exhale, right. Inhale, pull. Last one. Exhale, right. Rotate right. Slow me down. Vinyasa, if you're ready for your last round. Take some breaths. Under your shoulders, you're feeling it. Slow down your breathing. Five bear squats. Let's get it. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, here we go. Right side, right leg lifts. Step your left, right foot all the way through. Lower your left knee down. Under over grip. Slow me tight on the left shoulder. Here we go. Move a little faster. Sit it down and shift back. Cross body bottom. Inhale. Exhale, cross body top. Inhale, cross body bottom. Exhale, cross body top. Inhale, cross body bottom. And top. See if you can switch as you lift to a high lunge. I'll wait for you to get there. Over, over, grip, so nice head on the right. Inhale, press. Exhale, shoulders. Inhale, press. Exhale, shoulders. Inhale, press, back to front low position. Bend your right knee and open up warrior two. Widen your stance. Cross body top, under grip on the right hand. Right shoulder. Get ready. Here we go, biceps. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, reach it up. And pull it back in. Bring up the inhale. Inhale. Exhale, reach it up. Hold, inhale. Bring it back in. Last one. Great job. Lateral lunges to the left. Straighten your right leg. To the left we go. Inhale. Exhale to the left. Pack the top shoulder down. And left. And left. Great job. Shift to the left. Point your hands. Step it back. Vinyasa. Last side to go. But first, before we go, bear squats. Here we go. Five. Four. Three, breathe. Two, one. Big breath. Left leg extends. Step it all the way through your hands. Lower your right knee down and tuck your toes. Under, over, grip. Right shoulder. You know what to do. Sink it down and move. Inhale, shift back. Bottom to the top. Bottom to the top. Bottom and top. Maybe you lift as you shift. Switch to the left. Front low position, high lunge. Here we go. Press up for how to do it down. And to your shoulders. Inhale, press. Exhale, shoulders. Last one. Front low position. Warrior two. Wide. Find your foundation. Left hand under. Cross body top, left shoulder. Get ready. Inhale, lengthen your left leg. Exhale, press it up. Hold, inhale. Bring it back in. Inhale. And reach it out. Last one. Great job. Woo. Hello, biceps. Right knee, lateral lunge. Inhale. To the right. Inhale back. To the right. Inhale back. To the right. Good job. All done. Downward dog. Find your way there. Vinyasa. Rats, child's pose. Hips, your heels. Breathing. Slow down your heart rate. Slow down your breathing. All right, we're going to decompress into uh, recovery. So, get into your scapulas, right arm from all fours, right arm draining and reach up high. Pull your right shoulder back, take a big breath in, open space. As you exhale, thread, right shoulder and cheek come down to the ground. Put weight into your right shoulder and your right scapula. Maybe kickstand your left leg to the left, put more weight there. Use your left hand for support or extend it long. Left hand is gonna extend, 
or even wrap your left hand around your lower back and open climbing rotation. Breathe. Good. Extend your leg here, no matter where you are, extend your leg. Plant your left hand to the mat in front of you. This left foot is on the ground. This is an awkward twist, so lift, press into the left hand, and reach your right arm up and open. Come all the way up onto your knees. Left toes face the sky. Reach your right arm up and over to your left. Slide your left hand down your leg. Get a nice lateral stretch to the right hand side. Good. Come back to center. Both knees are on the ground. Moving on to the left side. Left leg extend. Left arm extends. Pull your shoulder back. Take a breath. And then thread the needle as you exhale. Shoulder reach come down to the ground. Put weight into your left side. Kick stay in your right leg. Put your right foot forward or to the right and extend your right arm forward or wrap it around your lower back, reaching for your left hip crease. Oh my gosh, breathe. Good, bring your right hand down to the ground. Press into the right hand, proper twist, left arm in for sitting in the pie and lower down. Moving into our lateral stretch. Right toes face the sky. Right arm to the thigh, left arm reaches up and over, pushing all the way down towards your leg. Great. Now leg back, come on to your knees, and walk it through. So we're not done with work yet. We're going to do some pigeon crunches into pigeon pose. Recline pigeon crunches. Pigeon crunches. I kind of made this up. So, bend your knees, plant your feet onto the ground. Cross your right ankle over your left thigh. Flex your right toes toward your right knee. Extend your arms over your head. Actually, yeah, extend your arms over your head. Tuck your tailbone into the sky and then extend your left leg to hover close to the ground. So lower back is flat into the ground, take a deep breath in. As you exhale, bend your left knee, draw your elbows up, shoulders off the ground, and try to tap your elbows over the top of your shin. We're gonna do five total. So inhale, lengthen your arms, float your arms and your legs off the ground, exhale, crunch. Inhale, lengthen. Lower back to the flat into the ground the whole time. So engaging your core the whole time. Three. Four. Five. And hold. Hold for your inhale. Stay for your exhale. Lower down. Get it. We're going to move into pigeon pose. Recline pigeon pose. Right arm is going to thread in between your left, in between your legs, and it relates behind your left leg. Or on top of your left shin, draw your knee closer. Flex both all toes towards your knees and relax your shoulders and your head down to the ground. Releasing your hips. Good. And release. Extend your arms and see your legs. Nice. Bring your knees, put your feet into the ground. Cross your left ankle over your right thigh. Flex your toes towards your knee. Extend your arms over your head. Pigeon crunches. Tuck your toe into the sky, lower back is flat, engage into the ground. Float your right leg slightly off the ground. Keep that cross of your leg. Inhale. Exhale, crunch. Shoulders come off the ground, bend your right knee. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, crunch. Good, last two. Last one. Hold for your inhale. Stay for your exhale. And let's put your feet, foot down into the ground. Thread the left arm underneath to recline pigeon pose. Maybe on top of your shin, relax your head and your neck. Good. Awesome, and release. <sighs> All right, let's move into bridge pose. Put your feet onto the ground, touch the distance, reach your arms out by your side, tuck your tailbone into the sky, and lift your hips up high. Try to tuck each shoulder in, and interlace your hands underneath your back, open up the front of your shoulders. Squeeze your arms and thighs together, and your glutes to the top, breathe into the front line, chin up and away from your chest, and release. Arms out to the side and just windshield wipe your knees 
back and forth from side to side, find, find the two pipe twists from side to side. All right, knees right, arms up to your T, look left, hold the twist. Knees up and over to the left, look right, hold the twist. And good work. Awesome, great work today, you guys. Thanks for being here. Thanks for joining.